Welcome to today's devotional from jdiet.com. Let's start today by wishing you a very, very happy Christmas. Today we are going to look at a devotional called A Gift Too Wonderful for Words. Today's key verse is taken from Romans 5 verse 15. It says, But a gift is not like trespass. For if many died by the trespass of one man, how much more did God's grace and the gift that came by that grace of one man, Jesus Christ, overflow to many. Today is a day where many people right around the world are going to be giving presents and receiving presents. There is much joy in seeing other people open our gifts and the excitement they have when they receive something that they want. Yet at this Christmas it's really important that we remember the greatest gift of all. John 3 and verse 16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life. God gave us something even better than what we wanted. He gave us something that we needed. A saviour in his son Jesus Christ. We often tell children that they have to be good enough to have the gift that they wanted. In fact, here in the UK we have a tradition where we tell children that if they are not good, the Santa Claus will leave them a lump of coal instead of their gift. So what would merit God in giving us the ultimate gift, his one and only son? Well, one thing is for sure. It wasn't our good deeds. Isaiah reminds us that we are all infected and impure with sin. When we display our righteous deeds, they are nothing but filthy rags. Like autumn leaves, we wither and fail and our sin sweeps us away like the wind. Isaiah 64 verse 6. It wasn't anything about us that merited this gift from God, but it was all by the grace which flows from his love. As Romans 5 verse 8 says, But God showed his great love for us, by sending Christ to die for us while we were still sinners. Let's pray together. Our Father, we just thank you for this Christmas day where we remember Christ coming to earth, God taking on human form, living amongst us. Lord, what a miracle. But Lord, even greater than this, we think that how you sent your one and only Son to this earth to carry the weight and pay the price for our sin that we may receive eternal life in you. What a great gift you've given us. Lord, today as we are giving gifts and receiving gifts, let us most of all give praise to you for the ultimate gift you've given us. In Jesus' name, amen.